And all right, you guys, we are back here on kick. We're going to start over as though we're fresh and new and started up. Uh, big shout out to everybody who's watching. Hope you guys are in a fantastic day wherever you're on the big wide world. We are streaming here on kick once again, you guys. So uh, let's play Bishop D3, Bishop C2, and Queen E2 like we always like to play. Keep it standard. Oh, right. I allowed G5. I shouldn't have allowed this. Uh, of course, I'll take and go back. But like d4 queen a4 he goes h5 logical i think though h5 might be wrong because now i can play f4 and maybe knight f3 oh thank you so much to ola for the subscription thank you so much to oh oh love appreciate it. thank you so much um do i play h3 is also a question i think i will play h3 and maybe try to trade the pawns actually maybe here i should have played h3 right away but okay whatever who cares Maybe not a very good move by me, actually, but who cares? Goes G3, which I'm actually extremely happy to see. I'll play D3 now. Now, C4 is a move. I think I should actually play C4 here. I think I should try to fix this. Go uh, Knight F3, I guess, develop my pieces. I think I'm actually quite a bit better here in the long term just because he has this terrible light square bishop that's walled in by the pawn structure. So I think I am better. Yeah. Okay, he goes A5. Of course, I'll play like Knight C3 here. Just keep on developing, keep on improving the position. Um, we get a4. Um, I can castle here to the king's side. It's not maybe the best move per se, but I think it's quite reasonable. Like if I take, there was queen a5 check. So we just keep on rolling here. Bishop e7 now. If I, oh, if I take, there's dc4. So don't want to allow that, but I also... How do I do this? I guess I'll play rook b1 maybe. Bishop a6. Wait, but now there's queen a4. But you know what? No, no need to get cheeky here. Queen a4, queen takes, queen d7. I don't see the continuation, so I don't want to make it messy. So I'll keep going. King f8, logical. Uh, I'll play knight a4 here. Maybe bishop a3 next move. <laughs> Hard to judge whether I'm actually better here, but I, I assume that I am slightly better. Takes, of course. Of course, I take, and did I just blunder some bishop e2? I did, didn't I? Unbelievably bad. Like every other game that I play right now is just terrible. Yeah, and now I just now I'm now I'm in a lot of trouble. Ah, uh, ridiculous. Yeah, I just totally messed this up. Oh, did I hang this too? Of course I did, yeah. I take and it was bishop d5 which is interesting I did oh actually I should have just take him why did I just take that um let's go no I can't do that I guess I'll go okay I just have to find moves I guess I'll go here um bum, bum, bum. I gotta come with some moves let's go here I guess yeah, this doesn't do anything. It's playing another terrible, lousy game after a couple of good games. Oh, that's just a blunder, too. Could have played Knight F6, maybe. I mean, everything's losing. Yeah, I just played a lousy game. Every, every couple of games, I just play a garbage game against this guy. I can't keep it together for like seven or eight games in a row. No, it's... Every few times, I just play... Or, Okay, now I just blunder with 97. Yeah, every few games I throw throw in a total lemon for no reason. That looked like one of my games. Yeah, I don't know what I was doing that game. It was pretty terrible. Okay, let's go 95 again and C5. C5 again runs into D5. Knight B3. Wait a second. Am I taking and play Queen C7? No, that's no good. Gotta be careful not to just like tilt here. Maybe tilt's the wrong word, just play a garbage opening and lose. That last game I was completely winning too. That's why it's upsetting. I was completely winning. Structurally, I was just completely dominating him. 
This game at least position looks relatively okay. Yeah. Am I playing a specific opening? Not not really, no. Um I guess I'll go here, why not? I have A5 somewhere, maybe not. How do I do this? And why am I thinking so long? That's the other question. Let's go here. I, I don't know if 95 does anything, but I'm gonna play it. Here, maybe 96. If C5, I can just take and go back as well. Let's go here. I mean, there is C5. There's also A5 here. Okay, it does play C5, but I thought... I take, I guess I take with a knight. I take with a knight is also a question. I think I'll take with a knight and take. There, of course, I can just play bishop e8, I guess, and rook d4. Okay, he allows bishop h6, which he should not have allowed. I have to come up with some moves. I'm going to play a5, maybe rook d4 here. Maybe a4. I mean, my position is not very good here, but it's playable at least. Maybe I go queen a7. I don't know why I didn't just play rook d8 there, but whatever. Go back. It was rook d1, which is not a good move. Because now I have rook d8. I can take the file, I think. I can also go here. If queen h4, I have rook d1, which at first I did not actually see, but luckily it's okay. There's g3. Okay, let's go. Bishop f8, hit the knight. Now, do I play f6 or do I play something like... I guess I'll go f6. I don't really like it, but it's a move. I have the two bishops. Okay, he's going to blunder here. Okay, there we go. Four to go. He's good for an NM. He's 25, 50 feet a rating. I don't know why he doesn't have the title. We've been over this a few times, um, but yeah. That's one of five. I'm going to try to beat him four in a row, and then we're going to move on to scheduled content, I guess we should say. Um, but yeah, we're going to get back to speedrun a little bit later on. We are obviously going to... Um, I think I'm just going to castle again and play like queen f2 or something. And rookie one, of course. I, of course, misplayed this as well, though. Um, so I'll go h3, play e5 again. Um... Yeah, he's the uh, strongest NM in the world, according to Google. Yes, that is correct. Um, I don't know why he's an NM, like I said. I mean, like, it just it doesn't make any sense at all to me, but it is what it is, as the saying goes. So, um, yeah, I, I'm guessing he just doesn't have a chance to play in Russia. That's that's my best guess. Excuse me, my best guess. That, that's the only thing that makes sense, in my opinion. I actually don't know why I'm doing this either. This looks very uh, questionable as well. Position's kind of okay, kind of being the keyword. Yeah, of course, he plays f6, and I'm already like much worse, I think. Yeah, again, I just play, I'm playing complete lemon of a game after a couple of good games. Uh, let's see. If I take and play rook a2, we'll just take and play rook a2. You can take with a knight too, actually. Takes with a rook. That doesn't look quite right to me somehow. Um, here. I'm obviously worse, but am I like worse to the point of losing or am I only a little bit worse? Let's go here. Knight c5. I feel like he's misplayed this just a little bit. No, no, he's actually misplayed this a lot. I'm still worse, but I'm not like... Yeah, he's, he's completely misplayed this. I'm still worse, but I'm not like outright losing like I should be. Now, do I go, I guess, I mean, I can play rook d1. I can also go knight c4, knight e3. I think rook d1 looks correct to hit the bishop. I'm definitely worse here, but am I am I losing is the question, or is it just a little bit worse? There's rook f5, which I don't actually feel like is the best move. Wait, if I go queen c4... I hit the pawn. I think I'm okay here. Yeah. Okay, so I... He goes bishop d... Wait, so if I take... There's queen... Wait, takes queen c4, knight c4, rook d5, takes bishop c5. 
Yeah, I'm gonna go for this. I don't know if this is actually good, but it... Wait, why did I do that? This doesn't do anything. It doesn't do anything at all. Oh, and I G4 too, which I just missed as well. Bishop E7, Bishop E5, seems okay. He missed Rook F1, which was a forced checkmate, by the way, but whatever. Go here. Yeah, he, he, he had a forced checkmate, but he missed it. Yeah, he had a forced checkmate with Bishop H2 that he missed, which is kind of funny. Um, Do I have any ways to continue the game that don't just lose? I don't know. Do I have any tricks like... No, Bishop D... Now Bishop D6 doesn't even work. Yeah, what am I doing? And I'm down, I'm down like 10 years on the clock, too. Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing. <sighs> Play some H3. I mean, it's definitely a move. I'm gonna go like knight d7 or something. Maybe knight d3. And of course, now he's blundering, but I'm so long clock that it's probably not gonna matter. Oh, and now I put the king on the wrong square, too. Yeah, I was supposed to go to f3. Ridiculous. Yeah, now I'm just throwing games away. I'm going to play, like, a couple more, and then I'm going to stop before I let the rating get completely out of control. I'll play somebody else as well. Because I'm can beat. i beating this guy by a massive margin, but it's not enough to not lose rating points. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to play, like, uh, three more. Three more, and then I'm going to play somebody else. Yeah. No, I have coffee. I mean, I'm playing fine. I'm crushing this guy. It's seven and a half, two and a half. Like, I'm absolutely destroying him. It's just not enough to avoid losing rating points. And now I'm playing another bad game here. No, I mean, my the score is completely fine. He's only an NM because either he doesn't play or Russia won't give him the title or something. I'm assuming it's because he doesn't play. That's my guess. I think he just doesn't play chess. I should have gone to A7 too. Why didn't I do that? I'm just going to go here in 97. Yeah, I mean, I, I think, yeah, he's from Russia. He's not from the USA. He changed his flag to the US for whatever reason, but he's not from the US. He's from Russia, just to be clear. Um, F6 looks like a good move. If F4, I just take go to 95. Yeah. Um, ask him to win more games so you can farm him. Yeah, exactly. Um, let's go here. Yeah. I mean, the question... I'm going to play H5 here. I don't know if it's actually good, but I'm just going to go all in. I mean, it's a little bit dubious because there's a C file potentially, but I lose 13 points, so I lose a lot of points. I'm going to go here and Knight B6, Knight A4. That's my idea. Knight B3 does not look like a good move. Um, but I need, to, I need to focus and not just blunder pieces here. I'm going to go Knight D8, maybe Knight F7. I'm going to play h4 here. Of course, I should have played g5, obviously. Goes b5, which doesn't look right. Oh, he wants bishop b4. Okay, I get it. I go king f7 here. Thanks to Allison UK for the four month reset. Thank you so much. Now, I'm going to play g5 to just lock the king side completely. We'll go here, maybe rook a8 even. Go here.
Oh, do I have B6? Maybe I do have B6. I just realized. He should have actually played Rook B1 right away. But anyway, Knight C4. Um, Knight D3, C3, Bishop C4. I mean, this should be good for me. Wait, Bishop D6? Wait. No, I have Knight B2 and Bishop C4. Oi, oi, oi. Wait, take six. And takes. I should be winning here, but all the pawns are loose, so it's not completely clear cut. Go here, and then I have rook a7, and I hold all the glue. Very dangerous, but now, now I win the game. And I go here, and king g7, and I hold everything. I have bishop f7 back, and no tricks, and gg, why not? I take queen b8. I don't see it. I have rook a5, and yeah, I should win now. b5, logical move. I could go knight c5, knight e6, maybe. I'm just going to go rook c3. Oh, he wants to sack, but I, I guess he wants to sack. I could have played rook c5, which is probably better, but who cares? Just there. I think... I'll play here try to trade the rooks or something he's trying to get go for something silly i don't know what exactly but something silly let's play b5 and now i can go rook c7 i can go bishop c4 seven takes d3 rook b7 d2 let's go here takes i just go d3 d2 rook behind the pass pawn very straightforward I mean, you can go rook b7, but I can just take and play d2, and then rook rook, uh, rook, rook c2. Resign. Let's go again. I, I want to win. I want to get to 32, back to 3230. Uh, let's play. Let's play this something different. Uh, world number one, uh, not not right now. No, all the rest is high rated at Blitz, at least in the live rate or in the uh, official FIDE ratings. On Chess.com, I think Magnus rating is a little bit higher right now. It's like thirty two eighty or something, or somewhere around there. I, I don't look uh, pretty pretty frequently. Um, let's go here in H four. Massive skills, rude. What do you mean? What's rude about that? I don't understand. Um, I, I don't know what the joke. I, I, maybe I'm missing the joke or something. I don't know. Whatever. I anyway, know. Let's focus. Uh, it goes d4. Actually, yes, that's a good move. Um, maybe I go g. I'm gonna play g4. It's probably wrong, but I'm gonna do it anyway. F6. I take knight d5. Bishop g3 is my idea. Probably not ideal, but it's playable. A uh, match at 3300. I don't care, you guys. Why would I care? Okay, he plays g5, which somehow I did not believe was a move. No, I don't think this is a move. I think he's getting a little bit too aggressive. I have f4. This is not right. I, I know this is not right. It's just a matter of how do I prove it. I can also just go back, I guess. Hmm. can also play f4. Actually, f4 looks quite good. Okay, he wants knight before 97. I'm gonna go here and play for f5. That's my idea at least. But again, I'm I'm way too low on I'm way too slow on the clock. I should have gone knight f3 right away as well. But now I will, because now f5 f6 is a very serious threat. I'm not actually sure how he's supposed to stop it. There's always all kinds of tricks. Okay, I go. Wait a sec. Oh my god, did I just no wait, what? Huh? Don't I just have rookie five and queen g3? Okay. I mean, maybe he just missed it. I think he just missed it. Okay, resigns. Let's go again. Three to go. How long does he guard study chess after streaming stuff? I, ha I, I, I don't study, you guys. I'm retired from chess. I don't study. I mean, you guys act like I study or something. I don't. I just play chess. Uh, let's go knight f6 and a6 rook b8. Yeah. 
Play A6, Rook B8. Thank you so much to Leon Degan for the subscription. Thank you so much to Leo Degan. For everyone who's wondering, we're going to be doing a couple things today. First of all, we have, of course, the uh, champion Chester, Magus, Carlson, Wesley. So uh, that'll be at 11 o'clock Eastern. So we have that coming up. Um, we have, of course, it's 926, right? So we have that at 11. We are going to continue with the speed running. He does play C5. Interesting. So I'm going to go D5 and take. <clears throat> Go here. So, oh, he's got bishop c4, which also, why did I not think? <clears throat> Maybe I can play like queen c. Yeah, why did I do this actually? One second, let us let me think for a second. Knight e3 is a move. I'll just take and play here and take. Did I misplay this somehow? Ah, uh, here I should probably take and. That was a mis- Or taking C3, huh? I don't know. Anyway, let's keep going. It's an imbalanced position, which is good. Very imbalanced here. I can castle play rookie. I feel like my opponent's starting to slip a little as well. His play doesn't seem as crisp as it did a few games ago. There's a thing I learned called castling. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, castles. Or he goes king b1. Of course, I'm going to castle. I probably am going to play a5 somewhere in here. I don't know when. Maybe here already. Yeah, I think I'm going to go a5 here. Because now, if knight a4, the knight's off to this side. I feel like he wants the knight coming this way. So if he has to go this way, the knight's off sides. It doesn't get back in. He goes knight there. I can play e4, which is a very obvious human move. Um, I mean, just rook d8 looks good, though. <clears throat> this knight looks off sides. Complete wait. I go queen g4 wait takes queen g4 knight c3 a oh queen g4 knight c3 a4 maybe yeah i guess i'll go here i want the rook on h1 not on a d1 because the rook on d1 is an open lane so i want to claim the open lane for myself here i feel like he's slipping just a little bit he's not playing his play is not as crisp as it was before I get the impression that Ikaru plays uncastled more frequently than his opponent. Is that true? I don't know. Maybe there's some stats on that, but I have no idea. Let's go here. I expected that. I mean, I can't really take G2. But Rook D4 looks very good here to play like Rook D8. I should have played A3 first, actually. Why don't I play A3 first? Yeah, I think I should. Should I play A3? I think I'll do it, yeah. I could have taken the pawn too, I guess. But I'm trying to mess up the position here quite quite a bit. Let's see what he does. Because knight d4, I can just take. Like, wow, he takes? That looks absolutely insane. Okay, this looks completely insane. Um, go here. I mean, this diagonal is going to open at some point. No, this guy is insane. I mean, maybe I could have traded and gone e4 too, but whatever. Who cares? No, this guy's insane. I mean, he's going to get crushed on this long diagonal by the bishop. Yeah, the coffee worked. Kind of. Still not, not game over yet, though. Takes e5. Yeah, actually, I should not have allowed this, probably. But still, I mean, this position looks so bad. I... It's actually not so easy. Wait, what? Wait, queen f5. Yeah, I think I go here. Because I take and take, and again, I'm just going to crush him on the long diagonal. Yeah, I have knight c2. I mean, this, this should just be winning because the bishop is better than the knight. And he goes queen d2. I mean, go here. Pin the tail on the donkey. I go here. Win the rook, and gg, why not? Designs, let's go again. Uh, let's play d4. Let's play something different. Played enough Sicilians to last a lifetime. Can play e4 here like e4 and bishop d3 is supposed to just be good for white f5 is actually losing if he plays it he does it again i don't remember why this line is losing but it is losing or no he's probably just going to take uh bishop b4 i believe king f1 is the correct move here yeah this is this is not good for black i think because of c5 if i remember this line correctly but so the show goes on yeah, this, this line is completely winning. I know because I studied this for the U.S. Championship in like 2015. 
Um, and f5 is not the move I was going to play. I was going to play bishop b4 check right away. Bishop b4, bishop d2. Yeah, this is supposed to be losing, as I recall. But to prove the point to everybody who's wondering, I didn't cast my king. So maybe you're right. Maybe I don't cast my king at all. Um, yeah, a3, of course, c4, take. Takes. Okay, I think I'm supposed to take. So check, I have 92. I mean, he can't castle either. This is the other very important point. Um, don't know where I'm supposed to go with the bishop exactly, but I guess I'll go... I'll make a check. I can also go queen b3, which is kind of interesting. Queen b... Ah, but queen b3, queen c6 is scary. Wait a second, wait a second. I know this is not great um, for black. I guess I'll just go this way. I don't know if this is right. I could have kept the bishop on the other diagonal, but I actually think a queenside castle is far scarier. Um, do I go to e2 or not? Also a big question. Yeah, I think I go to e2. I think a queenside castle with this, the king on this side and the rooks on d8 and f8 is far scarier than a kingside castle. Also because they're like queen b3 ideas. Maybe I'm crazy, but I feel like that castle is far scarier. Just a just a sort of an intuitive feel thing, but I think I think so. See, so if I go knight c3, knight d4, I have bishop e3 or something. I can also just go like king g1, I guess. Yeah, I think I just go here. I'm 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 fine with him taking. I don't care. Could have played bishop e3 too, I guess. Um, guess I go like knight c3. Why not? Develop the pieces. Just bishop e3, queen a4. Oh, I also have bishop. F Wait, does bishop f4 just win the game? Kind of. It does, because on takes, I have queen b3 check. Yeah, <clears throat> it does. Yeah, I have queen b3 check, and he, he resigns again. Let's go again. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I have a great score overall. It's just unfortunately, because my rating's so high, I'm losing a ton of points. That's the only problem. Otherwise, it's all good, but unfortunately, because my rating, like, my rating's so high, even though I'm, even though I'm crushing him, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm still losing points. I'll have to look at that again. I didn't get that position. The queen was trapped. He had no squares. When he takes the knight, I check him, and then I take the queen. That was the reason. Um, I mean, I can just, eh, I don't like the position. I guess I'm going to go, wait, what am I doing here? Focus. No, I'll just castle. It was a three. I assume I'll go here and just take. And then go here and play like bishop d7. Actually, I had this against this guy in a, in a recent game, I think. Right? I had something very similar to this. Just move, just move, just move, just move. Yeah, I think I had something very... Oh, it goes there. I did not expect that. I um, guess I'll just go here. You can go back, I guess, but who cares? Not me. Takes is interesting. Um, okay, so we're going to get another one of these two bishops versus the two knights position endgame. So... Could have played e5 too. In fact, I think I'm gonna go e5 just to stop any funkiness on the king side. Like, go here, bishop d8, of course, at some point, or bishop g4. Oh, I gave knight h4, which I, I completely forgot was an idea. That's fairly bad of me. Like, more than fairly bad. That's really, really bad. I mean, queen d1 hangs a pawn with queen g4. He is getting a little bit shaky, though, I'm noticing. So. I think I'm going to slide over and play rook g8. That's my idea, at least. Like, rook g8, rook g5. All the play is going to occur on the uh, king side now. Um, Don't really know what the best square is, but I'm going to go here and play, like, rook g8. There's e4. So I'm going to go rook g8. Drop the queen back. I mean, I am a little bit worse here, probably, but I don't think it's the end of the world. I do have to be careful. Uh, rook c8 is a move, I guess. I'm going to go here and bishop a7. As long as I'm not blundering a checkmate, I'm in the game. I go here and rook g6. Yeah, there's, there's no there's no actual checkmate. Shaky means the position is very murky. It's, it's unclear what's going on. So I go... 
I don't know if I play Rook G6 or not. I think I'm just going to de delay it as long as I can. No, maybe not. No, I think I should play it, actually. I should play it right here. Hack the Queen. I have D4, but I think Bishop A7 is right. I got to use these diagonals here um, as much as I can. So... Now, D4 is a move, but I don't really like it. And in a Blitz game, I think it's a very bad move. So, um, how do I do this? I'll just go here. It's a very hard position to play for both sides. Now, he does go D4, so he does go for the massive complications. Why did I allow this exactly? I do not know. Okay, I just got to pick up the speed. Pick up the speed and just go. Pick up the speed and go. I have D4, pass pawn, D3 maybe. I don't like the position at all, but it's what it is. Um, I play D4, their tricks like Rook H4 or something. I feel like I should go like here for some reason. I don't know why, but I, I feel like there's going to be some trick here on the uh, on the king side. He goes Queen F5. Um, oh wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. Don't don't lose your mind here. Don't want to take. I don't have a move though. I don't have a move. So you gotta go. You gotta go. I, I think I have to make a draw here. I don't want to make a draw, but I think I have to. Yeah, I think I have to make a draw. Oh, he's going to play on. Wow. Okay. I think this is very risky. Very risky by my opponent. Very risky. Um, let's take. Oh, why did I do that? He's got Rook B7. Oh my God. I didn't even see Rook B7. Jeez. It's insane. Why did I do that? I think I'm going to win this game because of the time situation. He's getting too low now. There we go. Ooh, that was a really, really, really tight game. It was really close. Okay, let's keep going. Yeah, let's go here. Magnus plays at 10 o'clock for those of you guys, or 11 o'clock for those of you guys who wonder. We will cover it, obviously. Okay, he's going to do the same thing. Um... It goes there. I take C5, of course. Like I said, I mean, as far as I recall, this is this is not good. I think this is correct, by the way. I think the way I'm playing this is correct. Go here. Uh, knight D5. Okay, he changes it up. Let's play Knight C3. But he still can't castle is the point, because there's still Queen B3 tricks. Like, that's why I don't think this position is really all that playable for black. Or can he? Wait a second. Queen b3, knight a5, queen b5 or something? Knight c3, b c3? Hmm. I probably should not have actually blitzed out this move. Um, probably should, should have used my time. I can also take and play knight c3. I think I'm just going to take and go knight c3. And if queen d4, I have queen b3, bishop a6, just king g1 and bishop e3. Well, first of all, I have check and queen b7, which may or may not be winning. This or no, it doesn't. No, sorry, it just doesn't work. What am I doing? Actually, wait. What am I? No, I just blundered. I, I should have used my time instead. I just blitz out this move, which is ridiculous. I thought I, I thought I had some something here, and I don't have anything. Um, what the heck? Yeah, I just blundered. Ridiculous. And I might not even have any good moves here. That's what's even better. That's what's even more ridiculous about this. The queen e1, there's bishops. Yeah, this is ridiculous. What am I? What am I even doing? 
Unless, yeah, I, I have to take. I, I have no other moves. Uh, this is pretty ugly. But you keep playing the game. Maybe I have F4 somewhere or something. I don't know. I mean, this is really, really bad. Um, or Bishop C5, F3 or something. I'm way down on clock, of course. Why did I do this? There. Oh, I could have gone. No, I couldn't go to E3. What am I doing? C5. I assume I. It's something like. Yeah, I don't even know what I'm doing here. Rookie one. Hopefully, there's no mate or some trick here. Yeah, there's knight C2. Unbelievably poor. I just threw this game like a total idiot. I play. I, yeah, I just threw this game. I didn't use my time at the right moments, and I'm just completely lost. Yeah, I just ruined. I ruined what was what was great. He played a garbage opening that's losing by force, and I didn't I didn't punish him for it. Actually, let, let me pull this. Let, let, let me pull this up. Let me take a look at this game. This this is completely losing. Knight c3, castles h4. Okay, that's how you're winning. Okay, let's go a6. Play e6 here. Go c5. Knight c6. So stupid by me. Go c4 and b5. No, I know what he did is bad. That, that's why I just want to take a look. Yeah. Go here. I'm too slow. That's the other problem. I'm just too slow this morning. I like my moves are too slow. Like you look at the time situation. I'm always down on the clock. Yeah. No, he played an opening that's losing by fours and he got away with it. That's why I took a brief look at that just for a second. But it's also why I don't enjoy Blitz so much once I get to these levels. Because once my rating gets really high, it becomes one of these things where if I win every game, it's great. But if I have even one moment of, like, impreciseness, then I lose a ton of points. Like, I'm just dominating this guy completely, and I'm still losing a ton of points. Okay, now I've got to come with something. I'm going to play A5 and B4, maybe. Should have played 97 first, of course, but... Here. I don't like my position. But I have knight f6. I do have knight f6 94 here. Um wait a second, wait a second. Don't panic. Let's just go c3. Why not? I'm gonna play bishop a6 and force the uh force the bishops off the board. Yeah, I got I gotta get rid of these bishops. Because knight's completely out to lunch on the rim. Once I get rid of these bishops, I mean I don't love the position necessarily, but I think it's okay. Uh, I was trying to go knight b6. Very, very reasonable choice. Don't have any good in between moves, so I guess I'll just play queen c8. Why not? Oh, did I just blunder? Wait, I rook b7 first, maybe? Yeah, I'm getting a little bit shaky again. But time is time is even. This, it's going to come down to this knight versus this bishop, probably. Um, I'm going to go here, maybe knight f5. Something like this. I've got to pick up the speed, though, completely. Let's go here, and now I get knight e4. Now I actually should win the game, I think. I should probably win, because I'm getting a great knight, and his knight on a4 is dead. His knight's completely out of the game. Yeah. Another 10 games to recover from the loss. I'm not playing 10 more. I just want, I think I want to get back to 32 30, win like three or four, and then just stop. There's also 92. Rook F7. Okay, I can play Rook F8. Yeah, this looks fine. Just takes. Knight G3. I think I just go. Here, force a trade. There might have been some trick in there that I missed, but whatever. 
we'll go here. Guess seven looks fine. Wait, there should be a way to win here. Wait a second, there should be a way to win. Is it knight e Oh, is it knight g4 maybe? Knight g4. And I, I hit him with these knights. Yeah, I hit him with these knights. This should be winning. Why can't I draw? Why can't I draw arrows? Is my mouse getting old or something? I can't. Why? Maybe it's low battery. I, I mean, I don't. Maybe it's low battery. I, I can't draw the right arrows. Yeah, I can't draw the right arrows. What the heck is this? Maybe the DPI is too. Yeah, I, I, I'm actually struggling to draw the arrows. Crash of the wall that may. Yeah, I, I don't know. Like, my arrows aren't, aren't working the way they once did. Djokovic getting bullied by the umpire, lol. What do you mean? Is he is he get is he yelling at somebody? It'd be fairly typical of Djokovic. Okay, I hit both pawns. Yeah, like my arrows are sketchy at best. That's a free pawn I'll take. Um okay, there's a pawn here too. Mine was doing that yesterday. I think it's the website. Oh really? Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah. I think I'm just going to take him probably. He just resigns. Okay. Go again. Yeah, I think I'm going to stop at 31. Either I'm going to, if I win two more, I'm going to stop at 31, I think. Here goes B3. I think Knight F6 is still considered the best line. Knight C3. You can obviously trade. I'm just going to trade and go here. Huh? Wait, what? Oh, I can't take with a knight. What am I doing? Wait, but I can take with a bishop? I don't know. Maybe it's some kind of dank theory or something. I don't know. Or is he tilting? He might be tilting a little bit. Or am I tilting? I don't know. Is, is this really bad for me? It's hard to believe. Because castles are rook h7, rook f4. Why is my mouse? Yeah, my mouse is acting really, really weird suddenly. Yeah, you guys, you guys, are, are, are other people having this issue too? Because this is quite, this is actually kind of serious. If this is for real. No, this guy is a very good player. I like, I can't, I can't, I'm trying to draw the arrow and it's not letting me draw. I mean, I want to say it's the mouse, but I'm not convinced that it is actually. That's the thing. That's what's bothering me. I'm not sure. The arrows work for you. Okay. So maybe it, maybe it is just my mouse. I mean, the moves are actually fine. That's what's confusing me. Like my moves are fine. Like when I try to make the input with the, with the actual mouse, it's fine. Isn't this just a lot of D six? And checkmate, this is clap. See, like, I can't draw the arrow. Okay, now. Okay, now I can. I don't know. No, it's fine. My mouse was hacked. Yeah, maybe. This is a classic X, uh, not X, sorry. The Ludwig logic checkmate or Ludwig blunder checkmate in the corner pocket. I should just be winning here unless there's something insane. It was rook f1. I expected that. Um, really, the only thing is after takes, takes queen e5, there's rook h7. I take, 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 queen d3, c d3, check, 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 h, bishop d7. Rook f, yeah, I think this is just winning. Yeah, I'm thinking about what the options are here. 
my old mask has the same issue but if your old mask has the same issue but like that's not actually my question my question is that why are my moves being executed then my moves are my moves are completely fine but the arrows aren't I mean maybe I'm moving too fast I don't know no the, the right click I don't know I don't think so but whatever Got to keep the speed up. Yeah, I lost a horrible game of this, right? Earlier. Let's play A3 and H3. Okay, now he gives me E5 here, which I think is okay. But I think Bishop E3 is reasonable too. Go here. I don't know maybe I'm crazy I mean it's possible I'm completely insane but I don't know the way he could the way he carved hammers his mouse every move I'm surprised it lasts more than a few months <laughs> funny go here funny funny man I don't like this opening by the way I keep getting bad positions in this opening I don't know why I keep playing it against him funny man goes back okay now he is begging me to go e5 I don't, I'm gonna do it I don't know maybe it's not right but I'm gonna go 94. speed run's gonna be a little bit later actually I think at this point I'm probably just gonna play blitz until the uh until the match starts that's my best guess but I, I don't know yet if that's what I'll do not sure three six I mean C3 looks correct just to consolidate the wooden shield Knight C5 I expected that and obviously take and go like Bishop E4 maybe I think I'll take and go here I have a Bugatti of mice yes exactly you guys I should be better here I don't know if it's like winning though it goes there I expected that um I can also take and play G I can also just go G4 maybe no G4 Knight C6 Rook D2 hard to judge Knight H2 also a decent move I think I'm gonna go Knight H2 to play Knight G4 I should have gone to D2 though actually but whatever actually H5 maybe there's even G4 here to get really really wonky it's a hard position to play for my opponent and for me but I think I'm I think I'm actually better here LeBron James is overrated well thank you I, I I wasn't aware that that was some something uh incredibly useful in life um Knight g4 94 Queen f6 Rook e8 check Rook f1 yeah I think this is good I'm gonna trust my instinct here that after it takes Queen f6 I'm winning but yeah see like why do my moves execute I mean like the moves execute the arrows just don't like the moves execute completely fine okay plays h5 I assume I go check and then I take and go rook d7 I mean this should be winning takes and rook d7 yeah rook d7 or knight h5 maybe knight h5 is also winning here Knight h5 takes check king h6 check king g6 check e3 f6 check I'm pretty sure knight h5 is winning but rook d7 looks very clean too but you know what if you know something is winning three f6 check yeah I mean if you know something is winning you should just play it right or did I just blunder the game away I might have just thrown this game away for no reason too no I guess I didn't I guess I have this and takes again though I don't know why I went for this because this was winning with rook d7 was positionally winning and I went for something that's gonna get sharp there wait but now I have rook h 
Oh, then he's queen g6. And if I go e6 or something, I can also take and play rook d7. But I think e6 must be right here. Because I can take and play rook d7. This should be just winning. E7. King e Yeah, this, this is just winning. And the other problem is it's a it's a very sharp position where he he's under immense pressure. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna try to go for 40. I'm gonna try to go for 40. See if I can play like three good games. Yeah, like the move input is fine though, so I don't know what the problem is. Like if the move input is fine, then why is there uh then then why am I having these mouse issues basically is what I don't get. Okay, takes like I could play 97 maybe. Now nah, let's just take, not not mess around. Do 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 do. We go knight h5, attack the bishop. Doesn't do anything special, but it's a move. I think f6 and e5 makes sense, maybe. Hard to judge whether this is a good move or not, but it's it's a line, I think. I just go e5, build a big black center. He could try some h3 g4s. Yeah, you think the right you, you think it's probably the right click is faulty? Okay. Yeah. So I need to buy a new mouse then? That's very sad. Let's go g6. I don't want to get my knight trapped on the rim. Yeah, so you, you're saying that the right click is broken. Oh, that's very sad though. That, that's really sad. Because I've had this mouse for a long time now. Um there's take. Go here and rook d8. That's actually really sad. I mean, I guess he can go b5 if he wants. Not really worried. I would try the right click elsewhere and see if that's the issue. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Fair enough. Um, castle and play rook d8, of course. He can still take if he wants, but I'm not worried. Goes queen c2, which to me looks kind of wrong. Just because I feel like I've got activity with the rooks. No, not whoops, I was about to play knight a5. I guess I'll go here, hit the pawn. Go here, activate the knight. I feel like I'm starting to outplay him a little bit. Knight d8 maybe was better to keep the keep more play on the board. There's rook d1. Now I have knight c4, maybe. I feel like I'm actually starting to outplay this guy now. I'm, I'm starting to get good positions out of out of most of these openings. Go here, hit the bishop, hit the pawn. Like, I've got bishop b3. Yeah, I mean, I feel like I'm starting to outplay him. Do I take or... I assume I do take. Do I go bishop a2? Also a question. Um, I think I'm going to go here. I should be doing very well. Like, rook a3, maybe? Yeah, like I'm, I'm starting to outplay this guy, it feels like, pretty consistently. Does Wesley have a chance? Yes, except for the fact that he has to win both both matches. That's the problem for Wesley. Um, Rook b5 is fine. Bishop a3 also is fine. Okay, I don't really want to take with a bishop. Um, Rook b5, queen a4. I'm trying to figure out what I want to do here, because I should be winning somehow. There should be a win, but I don't want to get too low on time here. Let's go here. Oh, he's got rook b1, though, which I'm... Or, no, he doesn't. I'm just going to take... I'm sure there's some tactic that I just missed, but I don't care. Six and a half, four and a half is already outplayed. No, but I feel like I'm getting good positions out of the open. I feel like earlier I wasn't getting great positions. I was having to kind of swindle a little bit. Um, go here and... Oh my god, I blundered knight c3. But I have rook b3 maybe. Yeah, I spoke too soon. Knight e5. Um... <sighs> yeah, as soon as I said that, I just blundered. 
shoot. As soon as I said that, I have to blunder. Insane. Yeah, and I'm just completely busted now. Yeah, I just completely threw this away. As soon as I said that, I immediately blundered. And now my knight is absolute garbage too. Okay, I just got to move and hope. Okay, just move and hope. That's a bad move too, of course. The fridge. Yes! Oh, come on! There we go. Come on. Let's go. Okay, there we go. Let's go. He walked right into it. He walked right into it with King F4. He's, he might stop here because that was pretty terrible. That was pretty terrible. Yeah, there was a fork. I think he's going to stop now. Yeah, he just said thank you, GG. I, I had a feeling he might. He, he would because he walked right into it. If he goes here, there's 94. And you get forked. And if he goes here, there's fork this way too.